Hey Rose, it's your girl Lashana Mayon. Welcome back to my channel. So you already know we're back with another Love Island review, episode 45. So let's get straight into it, y'all. Okay, we're starting off out of the gate with Tyrone and Jay. Tyrone is the villain. Jay is the hero. Jay is the villain. Jay is the hero. 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 Jay you seen Ellen's high conversation at first was not expecting Mitch and Ella B to come back. So let's be honest, y'all. Mitch was doing good with Abby until Ella B came in. We know the triangle that they had going on. Quite frankly, we're tired of it, so I'm glad it's over. But we do not see Ella B and Mitch working on the outside. That's why I'm happy that Abby even pointed out and was like, Ella. Like when they were sitting around the fire pit, she was like, honey, you came in for Ty. And she's like, oh, it's because we had history. No, girl, even when the other Ella, the OG Ella, even told her, remember a few episodes ago, when they were in the, like, the makeup room, and she was saying that Mitch, she doesn't have a type, and Ella was like, well, you did say that Uzi and Ty was your type. So let's be honest, y'all, no one seems that working, sees that working, or sees it working right now, inside and outside the villa. Okay, so, I'm like everyone else. I was not, and like, Katie is, yeah, it's Katie. So I'm sure they wanted Katie to just even stay on the show, just to stay on the show. So I'm like everyone else, even though Mitch is a big character, like Abby said, this is not character either, okay? And I'm happy, y'all. Ty is always vocal. That's why I mess with Ty, y'all. He will keep it real. And so was Ella. I'm not even gonna lie. Whitney has been one of my favorites up until this episode. This episode really made me look at Whitney some type of way. Like, what's your problem with Abby? I think it's because she's really close with Scott and, um, you know, they're best friends. And I guess she didn't want Scott to, or Abby to go back to Scott. But it's like, honey, Scott is grown. He can do what he want to do. That's why I'm happy in tomorrow's episode with the little sneak peek that we got, that Scott is going to stand up for Abby and like, hey, Mitch, only reason why we didn't get to know Abby is because we felt hard for you. Like, we could have been trying to get to know her, and she probably would have swayed and turned her head a long time ago, but we were sparing you. So, yeah. Whitney with the Abby situation, even their conversation when Whitney was like, it's the truth about the bitterness, and she said it's an opinion. Like to me, that was just plain rude for Whitney. You can be a fan favorite real quick, and then opinions can change real quick as well. So yeah, Whitney kind of pushed me off this episode. So I'm curious to see what happens in tomorrow episode. Like, I don't get what why Whitney has a problem with Abby. Like to say that it's a truth and not an opinion about someone, how they feel. Is just plain disrespectful. Like how she said she doesn't like to be disrespected when she called her that. I think she needs to check. Just because you're the fan favorite right now, that don't always mean you will be tomorrow. Molly and Zach, y'all. I don't see it working on the outside. I never really cared about this couple. So, y'all comment down below. Let me know what you guys think about that. I do feel like, like I said in yesterday's review, that Molly is dragging the situation out a little bit. Like, so even just to feel like Katie had to leave for you to feel secure. Ridiculous. I like how Whitney did point that out in the morning. Was like, she thinks because Katie is gone, that's their problem, and that's the least of their problems. That is the problem. But like I said yesterday, that is very, very flirt. Now, Ella B, Abby, Mitch, their combo. Obviously, when Ella said that she felt some type of way after the fire pit conversation, I'm happy how Scott walked over there and intervened as well. Because I'm happy that he's gonna do that tomorrow to defend Abby. Because look, to me, it's bullying Abby. It's giving. Like y'all said, y'all all team Mitch because he's a big character. And then now we're gonna pick on Abby because Mitch is picking on Abby, which is not cool. Okay, so we're gonna end off with Ty and Ella. I'm happy that they, y'all, they are my, like one of my favorites. Well, I think they is my favorite couple, but I also like Sammy and Jay. So I'm happy that they told each other that they love each other. It was cute, it was simple. Yeah, and I'm sure he'll be asking her to be his girlfriend next, so. Y'all comment down below, let me know what you guys think about that. Mr. F boy turned lover boy. And what you guys think about today's episode. And what you guys think will happen tomorrow. Because that's what I'm excited for. Make sure you guys like this video, share this video, subscribe to my channel. Hit that notification bell so you're notified. Every time I post, I brand new video. Stay blessed, my loves.